to roll and tube a fine art print. The basics you'll need is acid-free tissue paper, a sturdy postal tube with a four inch diameter and two inch wide brown parcel tape and obviously your fine art print. The shortest edge of the print will determine the length of your tube. Make sure you allow room for the caps because they will squash your print when they're pushed in. Before you start, make sure your work surface is clean and dry. Lay out your sheet of tissue paper and place your fine art print image side down towards the edge of the tissue paper. With larger prints, you'll need two sheets of tissue paper. Remember, your fine art print can be easily damaged when rolling. So with a gentle but firm hold, pick up your tissue paper and your fine art print and begin to roll. You want to feel a bounce in the paper. It doesn't need to be tightly rolled, you're putting it in a four inch diameter tube. And roll gently to the end of the tissue paper, like so. Once rolled, cut the tissue paper into the center. This will hold your fine art print in place. At this point, you can add all your extras, little extras, such as a branded sticker. And we at Ginger like to add a note to explain this is a fine art print and should be handled with care. Your print is now ready to pop in the postal tube. We like to use a small square of bubble wrap as added protection. Pop your cap on the end and secure. Take a reasonable length of tape and add half the width to the end of the tube and roll gently while the tape sticks to your tube, like so. Press the excess tape to the cap and repeat the process on the other end. Once you've added the address, your fine art print is ready to be posted.